Time for some action. Time for some action. Hey, what's going on? It's Mitchell Supus. Um, I'm going to talk to you a little bit about how I made my Flashbase website, as you see here on a video. And I'm on my website. Go over my portfolio. There I am again, my home. There I am once more. My resume. And you can see that I am checking out all my different uh, things about myself. Um, I'm going to show you how I can do this. Okay, well... First off, you're going to film something dropped into iMovie. And you see we got the green screen right there. And uh, you could use a green screen effect in iMovie, but I don't like it so much. It doesn't work the greatest. So we're just going to export that into uh, full quality HD. As long as you use an HD camera. And then we will put it into After Effects. And once it's in After Effects, we need to figure out, drop the file in. Okay. Ah, it's going to take forever because I have so many things open. I'll ah, just stop that. Whatever. Okay. And we'll close that iMovie, give us some breathing room so we can load things faster. Um, when you have your file, um, after it's up in your project, you're going to want to drop it down into right there. And <clears throat> then you're going to go into Keen, Key Light 1.2, but we'll try to get the video on before we can do that. So we're going to make a new comp. Start off there. Uh, where is that? Oh, it's in the project. So we'll drop it in one more time and go to the project folder. There it is. Menu. <clears throat> Gonna drop it into the comp and zoom out a little bit. Go up to effects, keen, key light 1.2. After you get there, you're gonna choose the color that you want it to get out. We're gonna do the green because the green screen. You can mess with the gain and the balance of the screen. I'm gonna put the green back in my shirt since I was wearing green. Um, yep, that's pretty much it. Once you're done with that, you're just gonna export it again, um, render it. And then after that, I just saved it to my desktop, and then I dropped it into Flash. And I'll actually, I'm not going to drop it into Flash because it's just going to take forever to load. So you're just going to make sure your background is black, so that way you don't have to get it right on. It doesn't have to be the same dimensions, really, just as being the same border. Um, once that. You're going to just want to export it one more time and then drop it into, we're going to draw a quote out of here, drop it into Dreamweaver is what I was going to say. And how to do that, you're just going to go up to, uh, well first you're going to create a table one by one. I'm going to insert, media, flash, and I'm just going to drop it right in there. And that's pretty much it. Don't forget to save. And... Wait, let me delete that space real quick. All right, save it, quit out of it. Um, show you my website, and there it is, right on my home page, right there. All right, well, that's pretty much it, so good luck.